In today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at Marvel Spider-Man on PC and seeing how DLSS performs. Let's get right into it. You'll see all my specs on in the description down below, but I'm running the game max settings with ray tracing all the way up as well. Object range I have at six though. That's about it. So we're gonna be doing a quick performance look at it. It's nothing crazy. I play at 4K 60 and I can get past 60 FPS with DLSS on quality. Obviously it gets better as you go up on the DLSS scales, like uh, playing on performance or ultra performance, but the picture quality degrades a lot in my opinion. So I tend to only keep it on quality if I do have to use DLSS. All right, next up, I'm gonna show you what I found with DLSS on versus DLSS off. So you pay attention on the back of Spider-Man on the lines, it shimmers a lot. It's like over sharpening the picture. If you like a sharpened picture, you'll like DLSS in this game, the default DLSS. I'm not sure why they didn't add a sharpening slider, but that's just how it is. If you're one of my pastime viewers, you know that I hate the DLSS ghost trailing that you can get on birds or uh, airplanes or objects flying in the sky. And Spider-Man unfortunately has it. Spider-Man comes with DLSS 2.4.12 and I wanted to see what would happen if I downgraded that DLSS file. So I used 2.4.6, there's better ones that you can use. But I did jump down to 2.4.6 and it's a lot better. So. There's less shimmering on the back of Spider-Man and the ghosting on the airplane is pretty much almost gone. So I also wanted to take a look at the hair on DLSS with Spider-Man. So on this test, just take a look at the hair. It looks fine. In a lot of games, you'll see a lot of shimmering and like Red Dead Redemption 2 where they over sharpen the hair and well not just over sharpen the hair they over sharpen everything making the hair look really really bad but i'm happy to say in spider-man it looks fine there's no issues especially when you're walking around and stuff i was surprised to see that because of the over sharpening i was seeing on spider-man's costume and on sky skylines and it's, it's just strange i don't know <laughs> if you're not looking for it you're probably not gonna care. So I'm gonna leave it at that. Also on a side note, if you're playing at 1440p, that render resolution that you're gonna be running is gonna be a lot lower than if you're running at 4K. When you're running at 4K, it's render resolution is actually 1440p. So it can render hair a lot better. Just uh, food for thought. So I wanna do a quick shout out to my new viewers and subs. You guys are awesome. Welcome to the channel. More videos to come. Check out my next video right here. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.